say noon, it's like more like 1.23, but I like that phrase, so I felt like using it. Um, today is September 4th, which means it's also Brenna's birthday, so, um, shout out to Brenna. Happy birthday to you. Um, I'm glad you were a birth today. That's cool. I don't know if you're actually ever going to see this video. So, um, that birthday wish may go, um, may go worthless, whatever. But happy birthday to you. Um, okay. So, congrats on your new dorm room, Emily. Um, I'm glad that you... Uh, moved out from your apartment, and um, by the way, your roommates were kind of weird, at least by the descriptions um, that you told me of them, so I hope that this new roommate is going better for you. Um, as for the failure of a football game that my team had against your team, eh, I don't know. I don't really care all that much, to be honest. Football is not my thing. Although, surprisingly, I am going to a football game in a couple days against Furman. Um, it's going to be fun. I don't really care if we lose or win, but yeah, pretty much that's that's what's gonna happen. Um, as for the amount of classes that you were taking on Wednesdays, like you have seven, that is insane. Okay, you have seven classes. I have seven classes my entire week, six right now because I'm actually gonna be dropping one of them because I actually signed up for a physics lab that I don't need, um, which is worthless. So I'm trying to get to drop that. Um, congrats on the leadership fraternity, Demi. Um, you are quite a leader, so I think that will fit you very well. Um, so, props to you. For your English papers, mm, that kind of stinks. But, um, pretty much what I have to say is I'm glad I'm not you because I don't like writing English papers. And I don't even have to take English this semester because somehow I exempted, which is like, um, Yay me, I don't know how, but um, yeah, you go have fun writing those, and I have fun not. Um, anyway, I guess I'll go through my week very quickly because, um, I don't want to run over on this video. So I'm going to go through my week. Um, last Thursday was actually kind of a stressful day because we, um, I don't know, I was switching classes, I was signing up for the physics lab I thought I needed, I don't, um, and I was moving, switching Spanish classes to go to the higher level because the lower level was too easy for me, um, and then I had, like, this architecture project that we had to draw, um, these wall murals, they're, like, the entire wall, they covered the entire wall, they're massive, and we had to draw them, and there were two of them, and I was like, ooh, details, let's draw the details of it and the different shadings, and, Basically five hours later, no joke, five hours later, and I had only gotten through half of one. And I had, therefore, one and a half to go. And that sucked. And so um, I was, like, stressed out this past weekend because I was always working on. And then I finally, you know, called somebody, and they're like, oh, um, yeah, I, like, did a little smaller scale version, and it only took me, like, an hour and a half to do all of them. And I was like, that's embarrassing, Johanna. Why do you have to be such an overachiever? So um, I basically quickly sketched the rest of it, and then it was, like, done. So, um, that, like, proved to make me less stressful because I realized that I am way too detail-oriented. So, um, we're going to try to work on that. So, that's my goal. Um, <clears throat> let's see, let's see. Oh, but yeah, this weekend I also went to a, um, car retreat over Labor Day weekend, although it wasn't really much of a Labor Day since we didn't have Monday off. Ew, that sucks. Now I'm on school holidays. Um, that was fun because I got to see my mom and some people from my church. Um, so, okay, let's ask Emily's questions. Let's answer Emily's questions because asking them would be redundant. Okay, um, my favorite class you ask? Um, I like all of them, honestly. Like, my physics class is easy. It's a lot of, it's like a lot of people in it, but it's easy. Um, it's all stuff I learned last year. My math class is me teaching myself stuff I learned in 10th grade, so... <laughs> That's also easy. Um, my architecture class, like I said, is drawing. Now that I'm, you know, trying to teach myself not to be so freaking detailed about everything, it's becoming more fun. Um, Spanish, Spanish is good. I'm glad I moved up. Um, oh, woman's crawl. Right, I had choir practice um, yesterday and on Monday, and that was fun. Um, my teacher is very goofy, and um, we've been trying to get through a couple of pieces. So, um, yay, concert on November 1st. It's going to be awesome. Okay, 
And then you had one other question for me, Emily. You said, what well, is my relationship with my roommate? Well, very quickly, we're going to play a game. It's called, let's find out what's missing in Johanna's dorm room. Hmm. There seems to be stuff over here. And over here. Oh. And there's the cap. No, oh, oh, whoa. Hmm. Something seems to be missing in this area. There's no bed. There's an empty bed, and there's like an empty desk. That's all my stuff, by the way. Oh, because that's right. My roommate Tracy, she moved out um, last Friday. Because she was homesick. And it was just too much for her to get through. So, um, being so far away. So, she moved back. She's doing community college um, near her house. She means that she can be with her family, so that's cool. So, um, good luck to you, Crazy, if you're watching this, because you're very smart, and I'm sure you do well. Um, it's kind of sad without you, because we did get along really well. But, I don't know. My relationship with my roommate right now is awesome, because it's just me. Um, but technically, I'm supposed to get another roommate soon. Perhaps this weekend. It was supposed to be last weekend, but as you can see, no one has shown up yet. So, I don't know. Maybe they're going to, like, give the boot of somebody that was, like, stuck in the RA's room, which they're not supposed to be in there, because we had overflow housing. Um, so yeah, maybe I'll get a roommate, maybe not, and we'll just be like, shh, no one needs to move in here, I'm doing fine alone, but it would be fun, I guess, to have a roommate at the same time, so I don't know, we'll see. I'll update you guys. And um, as for Katie's question, how am I making friends? Um, I'm doing well. The people across the hall turned out to be really cool. They write nice things on my board, like, Johanna's awesome, she needs a new roommate because she's awesome, and I'm like, thanks. And, um, <clears throat> I've met tons of people in my classes, and I've gotten along well with them, um, so, I don't know, I'm doing well with friends. Um, ate some lunch with some people, and yesterday I ate lunch with a girl from my architecture class, and we, um, we went over to West End, where they have really good quesadillas, and I've been, like, looking forward to it all day. And I got one. So that was fun. You know how much I love hate videos. Um, and the t-shirt idea, that's pretty cool. I guess I won't be sending this one since, you know, it fits me and probably won't fit you guys. So I'll have to go buy another one. I'll see what the rest of you guys think about that. Okay, one last thing. Um, I have a challenge. And no, it is not going to be, I'm sorry, it's not going to be a lame question. Because honestly, those are dumb challenges. It is going to be more to it. Um, what I want everyone to do next week, myself included, is to sit outside of your dorm room because I've already seen the inside of your dorms, whatever, you know, but we want to see the outside so you can sit in the grass and the stairs, just outside of your dorm room, and, um, while making your video, you have to hold your nose the entire time because people talk funny when they hold their noses, and I just think this would be really amusing to see, um, this go down, so I will see you Monday, Emily holding your nose outside. Um, good day!